much for staying with us this morning. I'm having a great morning, but you know I have a great life anyway. And my job is to get great guests, and I have Donald, Donald Faze on. Now, you remember him from Scrubs, but he's now on The X's, and it's their second season on TV Land, and we're going to talk a little bit about that. Donald Faze on, welcome to the Valder BB Show. Thank you for having me, Valder. I really appreciate it. It's my joy. I like The X's. I really do. Thank uh, you. I, you and I talked. I talked to someone else. Tell me, you t tell my listening audience, just in case they aren't as astute as I am about The X's. Okay, The X's is a sitcom. It airs on TV Land every Wednesday night at 10:30, uh, and it's about four guys who just uh, who are recently divorced. I mean, sorry, three guys who are recently divorced uh, and live in the same apartment uh, with each other, which is odd, you know. Uh, their landlord is not only uh, their landlord, but is also their divorce attorney. And that's and uh, their divorce attorney is played by Kristen Johnson. So it's myself, Wayne Knight, David Allen Bache as the exes, as the newly divorced uh, trio. And then uh, Kristen Johnson plays their, their, their attorney and landlord. <laughs> Which well, is I think odd. Both it, it, it definitely shows you how horrible of a... Uh, how horrible of a uh, 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 attorney she is that she, you know, she has three <laughs> successful men living in the same apartment because their wives took everything. Well, that's kind of part of the course now. I talk to people all the time, and I'm talking about in real life. Mm -hmm. One of the first things is when people get together and just say they have, especially if they have kids, the first thing they want to know, how much child support they're getting, Mm. Or if they're getting a divorce, have kids and not, they want to know how much money they're getting from the other person who has the most money. Right. That seems to be par for the course. I guess that's no more the, working it out. Yeah, that's uh, there's no such thing as working it out anymore, is there? I don't think so. People just want to know the next phase. Yeah. And to be a part of the exes after Scrubs, how much fun is that? Because Scrubs was very successful. It's a lot of fun. Uh, you know, the ex, the, 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 I want to say the scheduling for the exes, it's a lot easier than what Scrubs was. Scrubs, I'd get, you know, to work at 6 a.m. in the morning and I wouldn't be done until like, you know, 8 p.m. at night. And on, wow. and on this show, you know, I'll get to work at 10 a.m. in the morning and I'm done by one Monday through Friday, Monday through, uh, Thursday. And then our, our, or thir I'm sorry, Thursday through Tuesday. And then our tape night is Wednesdays, and those are our long days. And so you get to have a life. You get to get out of the house and, you know, enjoy things. Whereas well, when you're doing a single camera show, you're just, you're always <laughs> in front of the camera. Well, I don't think my audience has any bleeding hearts from you because you just named our schedules the way we work in our regular job, 6 yeah. in the morning, 8 at night, you know? Yeah, well, that's that's, <laughs> you know... That's, that's yeah, that's regular life. That's yep. regular life, that's doing what it what takes. It takes. Mm -hmm. As your career has really um, uh, matured, and where do you see yourself going in your career? Uh, you know what? I'm just riding it right now. I tried to control it before, and that didn't work out. You know, I don't think, I don't think anyone can control their destiny. It's, it's going to, you know, you try to manifest it. That's, that's as deep as you can really get with it. Uh, I uh, I don't That's know. True. I don't know where this is gonna go. I'm enjoying the ride, though. I'm definitely enjoying the ride. I, if you would have told me I would have been on a sitcom with Wayne Knight and Kristen Johnston two years ago, if you would have told me I was doing that, I would have told you you were wrong. And here I am now, and it's the best. It's the best experience ever. The Exes. When can we watch you guys? Okay, so we come on Wednesday. Uh, we premiere the 20th of June, which is this Wednesday. Uh, and we come on at 10.30 p.m. And it's your second season. And it's our second season, yeah. Well, I want people to tune in because I think it's great. Thank uh, you. I like getting the, the perspective of all these guys, you know. You got the neurotic in there and different kind of guys and, yeah. and kind of see into a guy's life. You know, we kind of know what women do. Women know what women do. Right. But to see into a guy's life post-divorce, I think that's really interesting. Yeah, I think it's, I think it's very interesting, you know, uh, also, guys are always looked at as the bad guy when divorce comes around. You know what I mean? Nah, I don't think that's I truly, think truly true. Yeah, no, I don't think that's fair. I don't right. think that's fair. But it's what it's what's true. You know what I mean? Uh, 
You don't see the movies about the guy being like, yeah, my wife left me, and him <laughs> trying to get back on his feet. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's not the movies that come on Lifetime. No, we, we re- no, you're right. We're, we still have, a, yeah, we're, oh, yeah, definitely on that channel. Right. <laughs> Donald Faison, you know, they, you are as, as personable as they said you would be in an interview, and I want to thank you so very much for being who you are. Thank you very much for having me on your show And the today. best of luck in your second season, and I hope you have many more of the exits on TV Land. Thank, thank you. you. All right.